Steve Walter just walked in and we're coming back with a... A Tuesday tea. A Tuesday tea. A Tuesday tea. <laughs> Steve Walter, let's talk about feedback and input because it's so important whether you're talking to investors or clients or prospects, getting feedback and getting input can be incredibly valuable. It can also suck. What are the key points of feedback and input? So I think the biggest thing, you're right, it can, it can suck, but I think it's who, what, when, and how. Who's giving that feedback? Is this someone where you actually value it, right? Do they have insight? When are they giving it? Are they giving it late in the game or early onset? We don't want armchair quarterbacks. Yeah, how are they giving it, right? Are they giving it direct to you? Are they giving it through somebody else, right? What feedback they're giving? Is it applicable to this project, to the next project? How much context is there for that? So I think those four main factors are gonna apply directly to understanding what's good feedback, what's bad feedback. We should add this into the how. It's telling the who, how. Yes. This is how I want my feedback. This is how I want my input. Yeah. Don't give me this broad stroke, right? Make it concise when it needs to be concise. And that applies to any business, any service, any client, any prospect, anybody. Ladies and gentlemen, Steve Walter. Hey. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, dude.